Hello friends, welcome to the Science Facts and this is part number 31. And before starting Science Facts, please do click on subscribe button and don't forget to click on notification bell icon so that you will get the notification whenever we will share new videos with all of you. So let's go for the first Science Fact. So what's new? Some metals are so reactive that they explode on contact with water. Oh, there are certain metals including potassium, sodium, lithium, rubidium and cesium that are so reactive that they oxide or tarnish instantly when exposed to air. They can even produce explosion when dropped in water. All elements strive to be chemically stable, in other words, to have a full outer electron shell. To achieve this, metals tend to shade electrons. The alkali metals have only one electron on their outer shell, making them ultra keen to pass on this unwanted passenger to other element via bonding. As a result, they form compounds with other elements so readily that they don't exist independently in nature. It's a great fact, isn't it? So let's go, what's next? If you took out all the empty space in our atoms, the human race could fit in the volume of a sugar cube. Oh, it is very small, but it is a fact. The atoms that makes up the world around us seems solid but are in fact over 99.9999% empty space. An atom consists of a tiny dense nucleus surrounded by a cloud of electron spread over a proportionality vast area. This is because as well as being particles electrons act like waves. Electrons can only exist where the crust and throw of these waves add up correctly and instead of existing in one point each electron's location is spread over a range of probabilities and orbital they thus occupy a huge amount of space so it means we can fit in a volume of a sugar cube wow so my dear friends i would like to tell you that if you haven't subscribed our channel yet please do click on subscribe button and please click on notification bell icon and please do share this video with your friends and families and you can always write to us in our comment section your comments are always welcome and i would like to thank you from our team of science facts and we'll meet soon till then thank you bye bye